Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. The teams then, Besiktas against Monaco. This is Peter Drury, and next to me, providing insights, will be Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. It's great to be here. The instantly recognisable sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem, the perfect backdrop to this eagerly awaited night of European football. Siktas shape up in a 4-5-1. Well, it's a system that requires the right balance from the five in midfield in supporting the attack and, and obviously protecting the back four. is pivotal. Um, Steven Jovetic, I think he could be the key in this game. Uh, leading the front line is, is not really suited to him, but the freedom to play from a slightly deeper position or from out wide can bring out the best in him. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Has gone out. Drives it in. Plenty waiting in the middle. Here comes another cross. Can he put it away? And the keeper barely had to move. That's just literally playing into his hands. Besiktas certainly won't want to look back and, and dwell on that. It was a good chance, though. Knocks it in gently. Goal kick. That is a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. And it's Keita. Good ball. Jovetic. The shot's on! It's in! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him. Monaco ahead, one goal to the good. Besiktas are already chasing the game, long time to go. Well, you can be very hard to regroup and work your way back into the match, but they've got time. Tries to dink it in, now it's Charisma. Charisma shoots! Well, that's something that will make the manager proud because they dug in deep then and they've got their leveller. 
Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Besiktas grabbed the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. He's having a look round. He's in space and looking for a... Gets up to head it! Good delivery, no joy. Ah, oh, this was all about good movement in the box just to allow him to get to it. Besiktas going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Charisma, Kokan Koru with the ball through. Can he shoot? In comes the cr and a header, and he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. very well to get to that well as Tesco Peter the keeper has just received an A plus grade and it's Lamar oh, he's sit high he's played him through Keita showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball but couldn't quite sort it out floats one over and he's made certain that won't get through Lamar. Jovetic. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Tries lifting it over. Oh, good interception. to dink one in big chance oh, the keeper's done ever so well well you can't ask for much more than that a difficult moment he simply had to deal with Chances keep on coming, they're awarded another corner. And the finish! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Well, that's confidence for you, distance doesn't even bother him. Class. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Pepe. Adriano. Pepe. Adriano. Plays 
it out to the wing. Oh, that's neat. Dicks one in. Massive leap! Goal! Besiktas! And the game is well and truly turned on its head. Besiktas are so well practiced in the art of keeping the ball through, wonderful passing and movement, and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. Besiktas get themselves into the lead. And they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack and flair. Jovetic. Can he fit it? And shoots! Tries to get it forward quickly. And we hit half-time. Besiktas come roaring back in quite some style. We've got a very different game now. So there was the first half. Oh, what a half. It's, it's been pulsating and totally absorbing. We're actually headed for a, a potential classic if this carries on. This is insanely good. Besiktas leading by one in a finely poised game. It is intriguing to watch and could easily go either way. Second half gets on the way. Lamar tries a through ball. Lamar. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Cook and Guru. Adriano, Pepe, Raggy, Jean Moutinho looking to break out here, and the weighted pass. A chance to play it in. Oh, that's not going to find its target. So who's he picking out? Jao Moutinho. Adriano. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. to clip it forward. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Lamar. Keita set up one goal so far. I think the first substitutions will be coming up pretty soon. Keita. Spreads it wide. Crosses it, has a swing at it! This could fall anywhere! Danger averted for now. Monaco showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Hitting hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Charisma. Cook and Gunnell. That's a throw. Cuts 
it out. Adriano. Now the pass. And it's Adriano. Chip through. Up he gets! He should have put that one away. Yeah, he knew only too well that to concede then would have been tough to recover from. That could prove a big moment in this game. Oh, he really wanted that. But that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows and the quality he produces. Raggy. Jovetic. Nicely controlled. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Norman high towards the flank. There's the ball in. Monaco need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Back to the keeper and try something new. Gets it upfield. Well positioned to make that interception. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. Almost there, and the players can feel it. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. What a match, what a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, they approached this with a very definite game plan, and I think to a large extent they remain true to that, and we can give the manager a, a big pat on the back. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.